Well, I'm so far very happy with my acquisition of the Blackmagic Intensity Pro video card. And so I'm looking at the MediaExpress software that I'm using to do the capturing. Right now, we're looking at my settings for the Xbox 360, and I'm currently in 720p. And so it's important that you have the correct settings to match uh, the input for the Intensity Pro or you won't have any image. It's not going to adjust separately. You've got to match up the settings, at least from my experience so far. I've only had it for a few days. So currently you see that the console settings are 720p. And if you look down here with me in the lower left, you'll see that that's the settings that I have for this particular project. Let's say we want to bump up the settings and the capture to another setting. We'll do that after we just do an initial capture right now. So I have the settings. So I'm going to go to the tools on the right side. You see that we have three tabs, capture, playback, and master. And I'm going to click on capture and you see the little icons with the arrow flowing and the uh, clock going indicating that the capture is proceeding. Move about. And I'll stop the capture. And just to see what we had done, I'll go to the playback tab and play it back. If I wanted to do a capture in a higher resolution, I'd need to switch not only the console's video settings, but the settings for the software that I'm using for the capture. Currently, I'm using their included Media Express from Blackmagic Design. Now I have the settings matching both the console and the Media Express. Right now, the display area looks the same, even though I've switched to a higher resolution. But when you look at the different bits of playback of the different frames, then you'll see that there is the difference. I'm going to do a few seconds of capture and exit, like I did with a previous capture. I'm going to say don't overwrite, since I had another uh, file, and I'll just move it up to the next available digit. I'll stop the capture, we'll play it back, This is what the 720p looks like on my display. and I'll load up the other file for comparison.